So we have this hacker disk. Looks like a strange floppy disk. It says Silbury Hacker Boot Disk on the label. It's a Pillowtronics t-shirt with a tube on it. The only thing I got from Uncle Chuck. I feel like this was his final insult. Hi, Dolores. Oh, let's go over <coughs> to the counter where we can talk. Ricky, take a look at my t-shirt. Can you make the tube in the schematic? Interesting. That was such a random yes, idea. Brilliant. Yes, I can make this tube. Won't be a jiffy. <laughs> that. Okay. That's just a completely random guess. My first guess was to what to do with this shirt. Here's the PF001 tube. Exactly how Chuck designed it. Thank you. It's a rare PF001 tube. It's almost the same size as the TX1138 tube, so my two pullers should work with it. Hello. So I'm gonna keep talking in English because, you know, I started streaming this game in English. But how's it going? This is awkward. <laughs> How do I use this new tube? My one guess is maybe somewhere here. It's a special tool to remove vacuum tubes in the TX and AT class. It doesn't work on that. Nope. It doesn't work on that. Fuck. Those are my two ideas. Where else would I use this? I have a few guesses actually. Maybe at the radio station. <clears throat> Possibly at the pillow factory though. Let's try this first. It wouldn't fit in that tron. Okay. Alright. Is there anything in the hotel that I could use it with? I'm actually not fucking sure. It wouldn't fit in that tron. No. Try to think. There's definitely none at the circus. Checked here. Hmm. I think But see, I don't, I'm not sure what to do at the abandoned factory yet Also not sure what to do with the pocket watch And who's got the explosives? Oh, this guy It's a brick of C4 explosive Better be very careful with this What would I blow up? I want to blow up. <laughs> Actually, how about we give the navigator's head to ransom? Is there some part where you need to use a shovel? Wait, where's the navigator's head? Oh, she doesn't have it! Who's got it then? Oh, she's got it. it. So there's a part where we used to need a shovel. Maybe you can just blow it up, but that's, that's a real shot in the dark. Great. More. 
just to be safe. Great, more. This is a security handbook. Don't need that yet. Open an account today and get a free toaster. It's a sheet of aluminum foil. Here we Honoring are. past adventure gamers who have reached this spot without a shovel and need to load a save game. That would make a huge Fuck. mess. Well, there goes this idea. The map is useless in this forest. It says, here lies a treasure of great value. Dig if ye must, but do not complain. If tis not what ye expect. If I had a shovel, this is where I dig. Well, I guess you do need a shovel. Oh boy. I feel like we're pretty close to the end here. Oh, and there's still this. It doesn't work in that. Shut up in there. We will too have colonized Mars by 2017. By the power of Grayskull, <clears throat> I greet thee. I'm off to check out. Didn't want to talk to him. Uh, I think I already tried this actually. The disc is in the wrong format. Yeah. Yeah, I actually, I actually played through the Day of the Tentacle remaster a couple of months ago, maybe. It's on my YouTube. But I just love all these. This is kind of a throwback. This came out like a couple of years ago, not sure exactly when. Hmm. What if I try to use the C4 Coke in this? Machine. It would be crazy, probably. Yeah, I think the other tentacle is one of my favorites too. I also really, really like Full Throttle, which has also been remastered recently, but I haven't picked it up yet. I'm just coolest right now. I don't know what to do here. Yeah, see, there's definitely four. They're lights. So we we have to find a way to move the truck. To the right here. No, wait, it's not here. It's on the other side. Also, how do it's we open this? It's locked and there's no handle. So you gotta find a way to move this. It's too heavy. Oh shit, you know what? I think if you could get the ghost out somehow. My hand just passed through the pages. He could zap the truck to charge it maybe. Or maybe we'll just eventually need to bring the battery it's to a him. To call the elevator. But how would we move the restraining bolt? I can't move it with my hands. It's rusted in place. Rusted in place. What could be good it's against key. rust? Hmm. It says office on it. Hmm. How 
How do you deal with trust? Imagine I would need something to cut it with, maybe. <clears throat> it's a special tool to remove vacuum. It won't work on that size tube. It won't work on that size tube. It's for a TX1138 size tube. That's a CT. It won't work on that size tube. It's for a TX1138. Maybe I need to mail the C4. <laughs> can't pull that. I am not sure what to do. It won't work on that size tube. It's for a TX1138 size tube. Th oh, dang it, we got so far now. I There's no path. have to figure out what to do here. The old circus definitely didn't have anything that I could interact with. I don't think the bunker had anything either. Shit. It's a brick of C4. Guess I could try blowing this door open. That would make a huge mess. You can open it and, and close it, that's, or pack it up again, that's weird. You take this for a while. Here, you're not carrying it up. It doesn't work in that. I better save it for something, I better save it for something else. It's pretty heavy. Oh, it's a brick of C4 explosive. Better be careful with this. Okay, this just raises so many more questions now. The fuck do I do? You don't start. I, I don't know how explosives work. Great, more. Great, more. Good idea, but not while I'm holding the C4 explosive. Would make a huge good idea, but not while I'm holding the C4 explosive. Okay, so we have to find a way to put it. That would make a huge mess. I can't open that. Oh wait, maybe maybe we use the thing here. I forgot about that. Hmm. 
It fits perfectly. Nothing happens. It's a Dortron 3000, and it seems to be functioning. Wait a sec. <clears throat> I think this this watch, this pocket watch fits in there. But 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 hold up, let me just pull up the manual again. Pigeon Brothers, plumbing. <clears throat> I'm gonna save, I don't think this will work because one of the things is still blocked. Oh fuck. What's the correct time? How do I tell what to set it to? Not leaving that oh, watch behind. Have to have I to... need to find the correct time to set it to. Okay, I, I know what the correct time is, but I mean I know how it's to find key. out. Uh fifty ninety-eight. The cell phone the cell phone has no reception. Fuck. Well, maybe it will have some reception here. No, look. It's 50.98, right? Maybe it's not. Was it 50.95? It's 50.95, that's the first thing I dialed. Why did I forget? Thank you for calling the Pillowtronics Automated Security Information Line. For today, proper start time for Station 1 is See, that's one light. That's not gonna be enough. <coughs> Thank you for calling the Pillowtronics Automated Security Information Line. For today, proper start time for station one is two. Wait, 30. station one? Ah, oh, so it should be so two thirty, then this should be two thirty five. Oh wait, it's this guy. Three green lights, Bob. You just need to figure out how to remove the fucking battery from the truck. Oh, that's us. I was cute as a kid. I miss that. It would be nice to have this photo of my family. I'll leave it here as evidence until after we're all done. I don't want to pick that up. There's a radiation sign on this silo. Must be radioactive waste. Just 
to know. It looks like the battery is dead. How would I remove this shit? It's an old discharged battery bolted into the truck. I can't move it with my hands. It's rusted in place. Just, I already tried the C4 bunch. It's I don't my think speck of dust. That will work. That doesn't move the bolt. I need a wrench. A wrench. I know who's got a wrench. Pigeon Brothers Plumbing, Electrical, and Paranormal Investigations. We don't monkey wrench around. Look us up in the phone book for help with leaks, sparks, and frights. Maybe that's it. Maybe I just need to call down. I, I always forget where the phone book is. Is it B Street or A Street? I don't know. There you go. P. Fourteen seventy nine. Hello, you've reached Pigeon Brothers Plumbing. We don't monkey wrench around. The signals are really strong tonight, so we'll only come out for paranormal related plumbing and electrical emergencies. Please try us again later. Fuck. Hey, Fofo. Ah, uh, it's... Uh, there's a lot of things going on in this game. It's like... It starts with a murder and you play as these two federal agents investigating the murder. But then it turns out that it's like some... Weird backstory about a factory fire that was blamed on someone who was innocent, and you play all of these characters to figure out what happened. This guy gets killed, and he's now ghost trying to find out what happened and escape the afterlife. So it's there's a whole lot of things going on. But I'm kind of stuck right now. I'm not sure what to do. I... wait, electric. Stick out! I'd better save it for something else. That would make a huge mess. It's locked. It's locked. That would make a huge mess. What else could I try? It, it's not really stressful, but it, it's very much in the vein of old school point and click games, and it feels like the puzzles don't always make a lot of sense. It's so a I small don't know what to do with this. With mat carved into the base. Mats. I also it's don't know what to do with this. I can't watch because no Betamax players ex I can't open that. I definitely have to find a way for this. Oh, sorry, a use for this. Also this. The plaque says it's a tiny replica of the Starship Isabel. I don't want to play games with my Starship now. Huh.
thing. Here, you're not carrying enough. I'd better save it for something else. I'd better save it for something mm. else. I'd better save it for. I'm just, I'm clueless right now. I have zero idea what to do here. It's a small wooden it's Matt. figure with Matt carved into the base. Is Matt the guy from the bank? I think he is. I mean, he, he's the one we stole this from. This is in the place. Hello, safely first savings. Your money is in our hands. I should wait until he's off the phone. I need to keep them on long enough to trace the call. How can I help, Miss Edmund? Can I still <clears throat> access the family safe deposit box? I'm afraid not. Your uncle had your access revoked shortly after you left town. I guess you can't tell me if my dad made any withdrawals or deposits in the last couple of weeks, either? No. That would be a breach of our client's confidentiality. Fair enough. Do I still have a checking account here? I've been cashing my checks at the convenience store, because I was pretty sure my uncle had control of my accounts. Your uncle did close all accounts associated with your name. I see. How are things at the bank? Very well. Thank you for asking, Miss Edmund. I thought maybe with all those businesses closing, the bank might be struggling a little? Oh, not at all. Your uncle had more than enough for us to weather the town's economic downturn. I wasn't aware Uncle Chuck was doing so well. I mean, the pillow factory was closed for years. True, but in his final years, your uncle began liquidating several valuable assets. It was more than enough to keep him afloat. Huh. What assets did my uncle liquidate? I couldn't possibly say, Miss Edmund. Bank client confidentiality and all. What kind of credit can a game developer get? <laughs> That's a good one. Uh... Oh, you aren't kidding. Well, you could get one of our basic federal beige credit <clears throat> cards with a $100 limit and an APR of 1,232%. No way, Jose. I think I'll pass. Goodbye, Mr. El Palo. Come back soon, Miss Edmund. I'm just thinking who the hell is Matt? Because I don't think he's Matt. We interrupt. Welcome to the S and D diner. To her. What can I do for you, Dolores? I changed my mind. I'm not hungry. Later, Dolores. Who is Matt? And what do we do with the C4? What if I try to go one of the holes in the circus? I am really out of ideas now. I just Crap! I wish he would walk faster right now. That would make a huge mess. Looks like a brat hole. Don't 
would make a huge mess. The trail ends here at this huge rock wall. That would make a huge mess. Fuck. <clears throat> I'm just completely out of ideas. Also, I never figured out what this was good for. It's my specks of dust. be crazy mad to play it seems to be out of tokens it seems to be out of tokens it's out of order it seems to be out of tokens it's out of order it's out of order it's a this is real frustrating now I really need to get Doug's shovel somehow. The fireplace is very sooty and filled with ash. Where is Doug now? There he is. Hi, Doug. What are you digging? All right, Dolores. I'm just digging stuff in the grand lobby. Mostly holes. But then I buries them again, all neat and tidy. Okay, Doug. You're doing a good job. Ta Dolores! D that doesn't seem to work. That doesn't seem to work. Let's see, I can't even interact with Doug. I want his shovel though. It doesn't work in that. The disc is in the wrong format. I'm totally caught up on my sleep. No need to take a nap now. These are in mint condition. No way I'm going to touch them. I don't need these. Pretty much memorized them all. So where would we use the disc? Where would we use the fucking paperweight? That doesn't seem to work.
trying to see if there's any numbers that are red. Dry brush. No, we're not going to the hint line. Save it for something else. This is Uncle Chuck's Index Tron 3000. Oh, that's the old shovel. God dang it. Okay. It won't work on that size tube. It's for. Finally progress after like what 38 minutes. I don't know if we did anything. Else. I guess we did the security tapes. Great, more. What the? F you can't carry this. Take too long. Oh my god. <laughs> A bag of tokens? God. I was hoping this was my ticket out of this. Dump. That would make a huge mess. Well, it's a bag of tokens. That's something. No the map to is use useless that. in this forest. It doesn't. Was it B Street or A Street? I always forget. I think it's B Street where the arcade is, so let's go there. It's my next lawyer's business card. Brent Bailiwick JD. Legal problems? We'll screw them for you. I'm in the phone book. Eat them. That machine won't hold this many tokens. 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 Now it's full of tokens. It's the fame. It's out of order. It's out of order.
<laughs> Not too complicated so far. It's, it's starting to mess with my head. Fuck, still going. I don't know if there's a point to this. <laughs> I wasn't completely sure about this one. It, I'm pretty sure this isn't what you need to do, this is just like something... Lennon's, Lennon's high score, maybe that's what we needed to do.
Oh, please don't tell me I have to beat that score. I, I will. <coughs> I need to focus. Bad run. Let's try some other games first. I like it when the enemies die. It's out of order. I knew it was out of order, but I had to try it anyway. Because maybe it will do something. And that's why I'm trying this first now. It's out of order. It's out of order. What? Wait, what? I don't get it. How, how do I play this? I can have five at the same time. Okay, one more game left. Oh, this was hard. How much do I need to score? 7100, that's a lot.
I don't know if I can do that. Oh, that was good. That wasn't good. Come on. Oh, this one's hard. That should have hit. That should give me two slimes when I do a double kill, I think. It doesn't seem to fit that. I'm sure it has a very important use near the end. <clears throat> That was bullshit. These two still and started moving at the last moment. Come on with the last moment direction changes now. Fucking hell. I didn't mean to double click there. How did that not hit anyone? It says Token Tron 3000 is guaranteed to dispense exactly one token each and every time. A maximum of 12 tokens wow. allowed in circulation at once. I'm already holding enough tokens. I'm already holding enough tokens.
Come the fuck on. Hitboxes need to be way bigger on this game. <laughs> God damn it. Even my best score is less than half rate to the high score. I'm just gonna go talk to Leonard. Maybe give him one of these tokens. I'm already holding enough tokens. Welcome to Quickie Pal. Can I help you find anything? He doesn't want it. Dude, can you score me some more of that clown blend? I don't think so, kid. I need to be responsible for the death of your last two working brain cells. <laughs> I think I left my hamster in the microwave. Gotta run! Let me that doesn't take tokens! That doesn't take tokens! That would make a huge mess! That would make a huge mess! 
But what about the phone here? That seemed to have been really busted. It's not here actually, it's B Street. That doesn't take tokens! I just don't think this is the thing to do here. Oh fuck. Let's start. Hey, clown face. I hate this last moment turns. Fuck you. Best score so far, man. I just don't think this is the right thing to do, actually. I either have to do something else with the tokens or... I'm not sure. Just wish there was confirmation whether or not I need to do this shit. Fuck, so much, so much slime wasted. I knew that was bad. I'm getting there. <clears throat> Sp 
Space slime. Goodbye. Wait. I think I have an idea. Scratch token. They all had like, like one was sticky. I think maybe the sticky one is something we can use. Gnarly. Sparkling. Grody. Wasn't there a sticky one? Shiny. I'm already holding enough tokens. That doesn't take tokens. It's a token for this arcade. It's a token. It's a token. It's a token. It's a token. It's a, it's a token for this arcade. I don't know. Fuck you. Coming token. <clears throat> I bet that is gonna be actually a sticky one, and I'm not mistaken. Not entirely sure what I would do with it though. Thank you. 
It's a token for this arcade. It seems to be out of token. There was a sticky one, right? I better save it for something else. It's out of order. 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 That would make a huge mess. Good idea, but not while I'm holding the C4 explosion. That would make a huge mess. That would make a huge mess. That would make a huge mess. Better save it for something else. It's a token for this. It's a, it's a, it's, it's a token for this arcade. I'm, I'm actually not sure what to do. Again, fourth we made progress, but it's so such little progress. Come on. Doesn't take tokens. I better save it for something else. It's out of order. Who could be afraid of a?
It says Token Tron 3000 is guaranteed to dispense exactly one token each and every time. A maximum of 12 tokens allowed in circulation at once. Sticky token. It won't work. The sign says a maximum of twelve tokens allowed in. Great. More. Great. More. You. Great. More. Great. More. What the? F you can't carry this. That doesn't take tokens. It's a token. It's a. It's a token. It's a token. It's a token. It's a token. It's a token for. It's a token for this arcade. Hmm. I'm not sure what to do. It doesn't work in that. 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 It's a key. Hmm. It says office on it. Open an account today and get a free toaster. to get into the factory to figure out what caused Uncle Chuck to go that doesn't seem to work that doesn't seem to work ah uh, fuck I'm just completely clueless now that doesn't seem to work it's too heavy it's too heavy It says Philip's dangerous device, and it has a red button and a speaker on it. Okay, I'm pushing it. Whoa. Fuck, I hope I didn't lose a lot of progress here. It's a Betamax tape that I can't watch because no Betamax players exist in this town. Blazing Saddles by Mel Brooks. I loved it, but not so sure about the ending. I, I have to. I'm going to have to stop now. I'm completely out of ideas, but I'll be back to this game because I want to beat it. But sheesh. for now, thanks for watching, and please do drop by again next time as well. Take care. Bye bye.